All right, now there are two versions of Samsung internet browser which Samsung offers. One is the default one which is available on Samsung phones and the second one is Samsung internet browser beta. The purpose of this beta version is to offer some of the upcoming features for testing and feedback. We will be able to experience some of the latest features which Samsung is working on. Now just a couple of days ago Samsung did release the version 15.0.1 for this beta version of the browser and this brings in some important security and privacy features. And that's what we are going to take a look at in this video. If you are new here on the channel, make sure to subscribe to watch some cool contents on Samsung Galaxy phones, Android apps and anything related to technology. And if you find this video useful, make sure you smash that like button as well. Now let's go ahead and take a look at all these new privacy features which Samsung has incorporated in this latest beta version of Samsung Internet Browser. Samsung says Samsung Internet 15.0 Beta protects users against fingerprinting. Now this fingerprinting is a technique that tracks network use to correlate information about users. Which means any third party can track your network use and gets access to the information about the users. Now Samsung Internet 15.0 Beta is meant to enhance anti-tracking technology thereby ensuring user information remains private. So that is what Samsung is trying to do here with this update. Now every now and then we do try to delete our browsing history and other data from the browser which gets automatically stored whenever you are browsing. Now with this new update while deleting this data it provides greater insight into what will be removed. Let me show you how. Let's tap on this hamburger menu and then go to settings. Here we have got an option called personal data. When we tap on this we have got delete browsing data on top. Let's tap on this. Now you can see under browsing history, so these are some additional information that we get to see while deleting the browsing data. In the previous version of this app, it wasn't showing any such information. Now the next important privacy feature is secret mode. Now the secret mode is available even on the regular internet browser application that we have on our phone and the same is available on the beta version as well. But with this new update, once we activate secret mode, the browser remains in secret mode as a default. We don't have to activate this secret mode every now and then on the settings. And apart from that, we also have an option to lock the secret mode. As you can see, it says you can lock secret mode with a password or biometrics to get the most protection. You can change this later in secret mode settings. Secret mode gives you the same browsing experience as you normally get in Samsung internet, but with extra privacy protection. Cookies and browsing history for any websites you visit in secret mode will be erased as soon as all of your secret mode tabs are closed. You can still save pages and bookmarks in secret mode. These saved pages and bookmarks will only be visible in secret mode. This is fantastic. We still get to save bookmarks in secret mode and it will be available in secret mode only. And here if you want to lock the secret mode, you can lock it with your biometrics or password. Let me just take you through this. Let me tap on this icon here. As you can see on the left hand side bottom corner, we have an option to turn on secret mode. When I tap on this, as you can see, it is asking me to unlock this mode using my fingerprint or enter the password. This is because I have already locked it. You can use this feature just in case if you think you need more privacy. Now here, when I tap on new tab, even this new tab will remain in secret mode. These are the two important privacy features which are added with this update on Samsung's internet browser beta. Apart from these features, it also brings in some new widgets to search the information directly from your home screen. This is more like the Google search bar that we already have. Anyways, that's all I have here. Do go ahead and download the beta version of Samsung internet browser and make sure to use the privacy features if you're worried about your privacy. Do let me know about your thoughts in the comment section below. Thanks a lot for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. I will see you in the next one. Cheers. Bye-bye.